it is like five past ten past midnight hello um on the first of december it is vlogmas um so day one of vlogmas yay um we're gonna do the video properly tomorrow so hopefully hair wash change of clothes less smelly um and we will reveal the elves properly to you but i can confirm the elves have arrived there are three of them they are named blondie ginger and brownie now i could give you a couple of guesses as to why we came to those names but when you see the elves it is a bit obvious we have no imagination at this time of night one of them has blonde hair one of them's a ginger and one of them's got brown hair so blonde ginger and brown hair simple um they have been they have dropped advent calendars off they've left sky a letter um and they're hiding behind the letter currently so photos will be added and we will do a proper update tomorrow on everything that's going on well when we get up and everything's going on come here come here no you're not coming here that way are you of course you're not you're gonna give me it back here again aren't you hello yeah you're not saying hello how about that way if we go hello me and that who's this who's that uh oh me and sky got hello hello yeah don't tell her in sky's tummy trouble problems at the moment so we have lady issues so we suck it all up on us yeah Poor grumpy more like a sky. Oh, day and sky. Yeah. Poor grumpy more like it. Eh? Uh, with those two. Yeah. That's right. So tomorrow we will do day one of Vlogmas. We will have fun. And the elves have appeared. So see you at the end of tomorrow. Bye for now. Mwah. Hello, just out the shower. Um, we've had a visitor overnight. Well, I'm guessing there's three of them, but we've had visitors. So I shall let Richard reveal. There you go. The letter card, there's the sky on it. Lots of stickers. Hello, we're here, it says. Oh, yeah. Dear Sky, Santa sent us to make sure you behave. We have brought you treats to count the days. As with others on Christmas Eve, we go home. So then let's have fun. Love from Blondie, Ginger and Brownie. It elves. What else are they brought, Grumpy? Oven calendars. Right, let's zoom in on these calendars. We have Santa. We have the snowman and the snow dog. And the snow dog. Don't forget the snow dog. And we have a doggy one. And then we have the three elves, which Blondie, Ginger, and Brownie. And there we go. I think it's easy to see who is who. Exactly. Right. Are we opening. Oh. Like I said, I'm sure these were bigger back in the day. It's a Christmas tree. You got a Christmas tree. I'm eating it. Have you got a picture? Is it a picture of a Christmas no. tree? Well, plastic. Can I tell her that first, please? No, you got to open it for her. Well, yours is better than yours has got tin foil in it. Alright. Both came from Quid Shop, uh, love. I have a picture of something. 
I'll show you a minute when I get the chocolate out. If there's 24 more sleeps to go. What is it? Oh, cool. And the chocolate hub. I'm not sure what it is. Reindeer or something. Um. I'm guessing it's a little reindeer or something. Can't really see. Finally. And finally, oh. dog, dog, sky, sky, Coca, Coca. Sky, sky. Come here. Come here. Yeah, right, buggy. What's this? What grumpy got? Ah, oh, you watching? You watch see what Grumpy's got ya. Yeah, I know. Just a little bone. Uh oh, there you go. Are you actually eating it? Yeah. And the cat's not got an advent calendar because he won't eat them. So. There we go. Happy Vlogmas. Hello. Right. So we've just seen the reveal of our elves that have arrived for Sky. Um, bringing in our advent calendars. And it's made us think, well made me think anyway, about the past. When I were a kid, we didn't have elves. You? No. It was only a new thing, innit? Yeah. But what did you have? Did you have just that drink calendars? Yeah, Christmas tree, advent calendars, them decorations you don't see anymore. Yeah, the ones that went from the middle of the year. Yeah. Did it go, yours go from the middle of the room to the from, corners? With, yeah. Like had, the metal things, aren't they? Yeah. Foil kind of cool yeah, foil. foil. We had balloons on the corners. And those uh, banners that say Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Yeah, we had balloons on the corners. Yeah, we had balloons at the end of them. Did you have balloons? I can't remember. Oh no, we always have balloons. Um, and yeah, we had our calendars. Um, but we didn't have anything like elves bringing anything or... Well, no, because they're only a new thing, are they? Yeah. They've only been around for the last five years or so. So, yeah. I... But, you know. Um... But, yeah, I could never wait to get up and have my little bit of chocolate for breakfast. It was the only thing that had let me... Only time my mum and dad would let me have chocolate for breakfast was with the advent calendars. You? Well, I think so. I can't remember ever having chocolate otherwise. But I can't really remember breakfast or anything. I, I, I don't have a great memory of things from when I was a kid. Yeah. For, for whatever reason. See, I... Um... I remember some things, but I don't remember, like, breakfast or... Yeah. So I remember us having a, kind of having a breakfast because I had to get a breakfast before I uh, went off to Kelly's or whatever when I was a bit older um, and because I'd be at Kelly's for like eight um, and then we'd be on school bus to school together so yeah we, my phone keeps buzzing but um But yeah, we had breakfast, have a bit of chocolate and then go down. I'd go down to Kelly's and meet Kelly and get on the school bus at hers. Um, well, until we moved to Lupsit and then when we moved to Lupsit, um, I'd get the one or two into town and Kelly would get the... One one four bus to Eastmore and I'd jump on that bus and meet her there and get on there. Um I'll meet her at school. So 
but after school would either get us home together or walk it back home. Oh, I was in trouble for walking it back home. Because we'd spend us bus fares on getting food or whatever at dinner time. So we'd get nice dinner. Oh, I've just realised you're not in. Well, I don't think it really matters. It's your talking about it. Uh, uh, um, but we were saying this about dinners. Um, at our school from like year seven, we were allowed out at dinner time because there was like the chip shop at the top of the school drive. And if we went out the side gates uh, onto the terminus, there was sandwich shops, normal shops, um, where we could get stuff to eat there. So we didn't have to stay in the school to eat. We could go either to chip shop or to the term to get like a sandwich or whatever. Yeah. And you were saying you weren't allowed out until well, you were older. I can't remember um, if we're allowed out in year 10 and 11. I can't remember. I know we were definitely allowed out in sixth form because we always went down to chip shop and stuff. Yeah. Because uh, they had school specials on it. I think it was a pound for like sausage chips and a drink. Yeah. Ours was um, like that, but we were like, from year seven, we were allowed to do, go and have that, go and do that. We were allowed out from year seven, but I can't, I can't remember going out in year ten, or I can't remember going out yeah. in year ten, or eleven, but I might have done, I just don't remember. That's where I developed my love of scallop butties as well, though. A couple of scallops in a bread cake. So. But you you enjoyed school, didn't you, and you liked it, so mm. you probably remember more about it than I do. Yeah. So... But I'd have thought not liking school, you just still remembered. Well, yeah, but I think that's just like stuff that happened on a daily basis, isn't it? So, like, I can't remember going out yeah. the last time because it, just... it was either not out of the ordinary. I, I, I don't think we did, but I can't remember. Yeah. I think we were probably allowed out, I just didn't bother. <laughs> we would go to the park, there'd be times we'd go to the park. Or to the pig farm, or to friends' houses, or slash by friends' houses for me. Um, so, because you've heard the tales of when, uh, yeah. when I went and skive school um, at like a by friends' house, and they school truant officer came knocking on his door so we were all hidden behind a sofa because he'd skive school that much that the truant officer had come to check on him while he was off while there were about three or four of those of us from school so we're all hidden behind this sofa giggling By then, so yeah all hidden behind this sofa giggling Wait for it to go away. So, Richard has got what is either a near infection or a tooth infection. But because he spiked the temperature and he's been near me and I've had COVID, he's had to have a COVID test on. <coughs> so, was, yeah, don't start coughing. Yeah, no, I'm just coughing every so often just to know. Yeah, so um, we're waiting on his COVID test results coming back to... Um, let us know whether or not it's positive or negative and i'm guessing it's going to come back negative because mine came back a lot quicker than this and was positive so i'm assuming or hoping might just be wishful thinking that is this coming back negative so try to hide my neck look i can just my zoom neck. in on the edit if you want zoom in what on my neck no zoom in on your face <laughs> 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 Have we not seen how to do it? I need a teacher how to edit, don't I? <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to be teaching me how to oh, edit no. so I can yeah. do stuff myself, but... Because so um, I've not done any of those kind of things, you forget. I can turn you black and white and all that kind of rubbish. Yeah, because you forget that I've not done no. these kind of things. I just now nick your phone and say, let's go and do a video. But this is Vlogmas, so he has no excuse for 24 days, but to come and do videos. So. 
there. Well, it's not as if we can escape at the minute, is it? I'm stuck inside. Wow. Tomorrow, lockdown ends, and you're stuck inside for how many days? Another six days or something. I need to do stuff as well. So, yeah, but if it comes back negative, you can go do your things. Yeah. It's just until then. Can I not go do your things for you? Do you want to go find stuff in boxes at my mum's? Yeah, I'll burn them. Yeah. I know where most of them are. It's just you'd have to go through everything to find them, and it's yeah. not worth the hassle. And what the hassle of me burning them? No, just the hassle of you having to find them. You know, because I know where. Yeah. There's no filing system. But I know where things are. Or at least I think so. I know where things are. Because most of the time I do. So, I don't know. Well, finish. I don't have long to let it on then. Well, I like that your mum has said that your stuff can stay at her house. Yeah. Where are you gone? Yeah, I like that your mum said that you can stay at her house. Uh, not you. Her stuff can, your stuff can stay at her house. Well, I'll stay there. Yeah, you stay there. I'll move into the bungalow alone. But I'm taking the big bed. Yeah. Yeah. You I can have that single you. one. Yeah. You can have a single bed. <laughs> the one that's upstairs. Yeah. Um, got notification that the Christmas tree has been dispatched. So, I've been cheeky and I've emailed the council again and said, will we be here for Christmas so I know whether or not to put the Christmas tree up? Because I don't want to have to put it up and take it down and put it up again. No. So, but we'll see. It's much easier that way, wasn't it? Yeah, so just gonna, I just said we're going to be here for Christmas or not, just tell me. So I know what to do with this bloody Christmas tree. Um, we are waiting for dinner coming. We are having a KFC. What are you having from KFC? Bonus banquet. We always have a bonus banquet. What are your sides and stuff? Gravy and chips. Gravy and chips. Have I got chips coming? Yeah, I'm gonna say I've got I'm having a zinger tower meal thing. We were gonna have an actual dinner but Yeah. We were we we're gonna have like the beef's done, isn't it? Yeah. So we we're gonna have a proper dinner. But we realised I've been paid, so um I'm having a treat. Zinger Tower meal thing. Um, but I've also got a popcorn chicken and gravy and corn cob and chips. I love the gravy. I love the corn cobs. I love the popcorn chicken. I love the corn cobs. And all of us in a tower thing. I'm not a fan of the chips, but the gravy takes away the with chips and you can't have a burger without chips so I don't know so we need to figure out what to talk about tomorrow on vlogmas if you've got any ideas write them in the comments and let us know um, if you don't have any ideas still write in the comments and let us know um, well, let us know what you've had for dinner and how are you preparing for Christmas um, Richard what? look interested I haven't listened to you because I was going to end it then Why? but for you not looking interested I might go on for another hour yay yeah, mate I'll just cut me out of it <laughs> Um, right, so, it's, Vlogmas? Yes, it is Vlogmas. Oh, yeah. Shut up. Can I have like a second to get my brain working again? It's 1st of December and if Richard's not here on the 2nd of December, 
start looking in the back garden. I'm under, I'm under the gar uh, under the greenhouse. Yeah, possibly. So the dogs that are around the greenhouse. What about our dog though? She still goes into the greenhouse through the door that's not there. Oh yeah, she. We've had the greenhouse taken down. How much of the greenhouse is actually left? I don't think it's just like the bottom bits. Um, like there is no actual structure to it. There's no. nothing that actually stood up. So, but she still walks around and goes in where the door was, even though there's nothing there to stop her walking straight in. There is no up structure. There is no glass. Glass. There is no metal. There is no nothing there <clears throat> to kind of stop her going in. Even me and him could walk and step straight in, no issue. But she walks around and in through a door that is not there anymore. And then she backs herself out, doesn't she? So that she's kind of getting herself out of the door rather than just walking out the sides that are not there. Is that a dog thing? It's weird, isn't it? Um, but yeah, what I was going to say, today is the 1st of December, the first day of Vlogmas. Um, the elves are back, they have brought um, advent calendars, we're going to say selection boxes then. So, chocolate for breakfast, the dog's getting a treat. Um, we are not sure what we're going to do for the rest of Vlogmas, but... We're going to do a video every single day until Christmas. And on Christmas Day, we will still do a video. But you never know. I may actually be tipsy because I might have finally got off the IV antibiotics. And we may finally just be able to relax for a day and have fun. So, good luck with that video. Richard. Yeah, I'm listening. Good luck with that video on the 25th if they allow us. Uh, if I am off antibiotics and I am allowed to have alcohol. Mrs. I can drink, I haven't had alcohol for like a year or so. Having alcohol is going to be fun, isn't it? Well, so. food's going to be easy. Yeah, I am wrapping up. So I'm just saying about how to prove you don't listen. I'm saying how we're doing Vlogmas every day of the month. Uh, well, not the month, but until Christmas. And we shall do something on Christmas Day. But I might be a little bit tipsy for the nurses. I'm not needed anymore if I'm not on IV antibiotics anymore. So good luck with that video is what I was saying. And now you're moaning. And every time you moan, I carry on talking. Have you not noticed this? Grumpy. Yes. Yes. You're not saying bye-bye then? Bye. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a good day. Bye.